Hello everybody and welcome back to my time at Sandrock where today we are still trying to do commissions um, so there's some quite big ones so they're kind of worth it but we're trying to do commissions to get mushrooms for the stuffed meat mushroom recipe and also I need to try and get meat for that as well looks like we've got some post this morning um, I'm also trying to find opals for my iron spear uh, one as well. And I could, it said that they're in the civil core shop, but they aren't. So, uh, they may be in the vending machines. So I'll see. Letter from Ma. Uh, Nia just got back to Highwind. She came to our house and gushed about you for ages. She also gave us some sand jujube cake. It was really lovely. Looks like she had a great time in Sandrock. She even showed us the photo you took. It made me look very tired. Seeing your workshop made me and your pa so proud, but make sure you pay attention to your health, not just your work, okay? <laughs> I wonder if that says that because of my eyes. Ooh, I'm not sure, but we shall see. Okay, so hopefully today I will have enough plastic shells to at least get cheese um, stuff done. So I got three plastic shells from that one. I've now got set. Yes, right, okay. So we've got enough to hand into cheese, and I definitely think we will easily be able to just pretty soon get enough for the uh i've got 14 out of eight plastic shells see i was all worried about them and it, and it was fine once i started actually melting the scrap down properly or recycling it so let's uh track oh seven out of nine i need nine okay Right, so I think the first thing I'm going to do then is head over to the Yakmel Ranch and see if the meat respawns at all. I may talk to Cooper about his job as well. Hey there! Ranch part time work. Yeah. Well, let old Coop tell you something. Come to me, I'll give you good money, real money, to pick up that there feces from my ranch. How about it? Sure. Back again, huh? Well, you know, it takes a long darn time to get this manure cleaned up. You here to give me another hand, helping oh, hand? Yeah. Yep, sure. What do I have to do then? I'll just track that one instead now. So go into the Yakmal Ranch and pick up five poos. Don't know what I have to do for my Yakmal every day. Although why you would pick up poos from a Yakmel field, I don't know. I've certainly never seen farmers out there shoveling the cow pads off the field. Okay, give me my money. That was disgusting. <laughs> There's a, a shop by the barn there. Oh, is that for animals? That's the ranch store. Baby animals. You can sell the animals you already own. Okay, cool. And they will go into the correct housing straight away. So I could sell. Oh, I can't sell doodles, apparently. Oh, I can. 1,276 for doodles. Little chickies and little bunnies. So I need to get bunny and chick uh, housing. But I'm waiting to upgrade my uh, my area a little bit first. So, Mr. Coop, I have finished your task. Mm -hmm. Still ain't finished picking that up for me? Well, what? You weren't really bothered by it? What? Hello? Yeah? There we are. Looks like you're a quick worker. Ain't bad. Keep an eye out. I post a few jobs from time to time. Anyway, come on, take your pay. Get you later. I was a bit worried then. I was like, I did it. What's wrong? Oh. All right, so let's have a look at the Yakmal Ranch store and see if the meat is uh, replenished. It hasn't, so I'll need to just like quickly take down a couple of wild Yakmal probably. So yeah, if you're wanting to completely do like a no killing of, of uh, innocent animals sort of run, then you need to be a bit careful about uh, managing that and making sure that you don't leave it. 
you don't leave it past the point it goes back to 10. Right, so let's see if any of the mushrooms at all have respawned. I'm not as worried about the meat as I am about the mushrooms, honestly. Because this is the only place that I know of where there are mushrooms. And I don't know that they're going to respawn all that quickly. Let me just check how many days I had to do that. Um, sometimes those ones are a bit longer, so maybe... Five days and two hours. So I could have, if I planted them yesterday, just about got away with it. Oh well. I will cook what I've got, which is tens worth. And we shall see if we can, maybe before the time runs out, we'll be able to get it done. But also, there was a thing about planting mushrooms, and I'm actually kind of interested in that, because I think if I'm going to be given, like, a lot of money for them, I might get, get, you know, get a nice stack of mushrooms, and I can make that when it comes up. So, it might be a good thing, but... I was given a... Although mushrooms grow in the desert, have grown in the desert, sorry, have adapted to the dry environment of the desert a little. They only grow during the relatively humid season of the year found in sand rock. Grows best in summer and can grow in six days. Well, I might do a bit of planting then. It's been a long time since I've done any planting. Let's see if I can remember. So create straw grid. I think I have at least six strains of mushroom. Um, select type. Mushroom strains. Okay, and then I'm going to go, um, uh, well, I'll put the water on them, may as well. Apparently they have enough water, so that's nice. Okay. Um, fertilizer? Apparently those are just nice, nicely already dealt with plots from last time I planted something. That's pretty nice. Okay, let's have a look at the cooking station. Meat stuff, mushrooms, or we'll make 10. I need to make 12, but mm, maybe I'll be able to, maybe they'll regrow, maybe these will grow in time. I don't think they will, though. They're going to plant mode and look at them. Five days and ten hours, they're going to be just very slightly too slow. But, you know what, that means that next time I'll probably have plenty of them. Right, so the next thing I needed to do, other than... Oh, well, I can actually have a look and see if there's any more plastic now. More plastic shells. One. Two. Yep, I've got enough. Right, so we can hand in the plastic shells to Chi and then go looking for opals. There's a good chance that the mushrooms might respawn. And I may have a look and see if there's anywhere else that, that they show up. I'm looking around the Yakmal Ranch as if, like, maybe they would they would swarm there. But the only place I've ever seen them before. And I have looked around quite thoroughly. Is that little bit by me there? 
so I don't know. I doubt that going out right out into the desert is going to get me desert mushrooms. Whether possibly I might get some from the hazardous ruins, that's a possibility. But yeah, let's go and see Chi, and then I'm going to go into the hazardous ruins, and we're maybe going to see if we can find opals. Because I'm kind of getting a bit annoyed at how long these commissions are taking me. I'm supposed to be like, boom, 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 three a day. <laughs> Get that money. Hello. Well met. There's your commission. Appears usable. Oh, Good thanks. Time. Lovely. Right, so my next... Uh, yeah, iron spear, mushrooms, and meat. I can take one commission at a time at the moment now until those other ones are done, so it's kind of annoying. Never mind. I do wonder whether, like, maybe some of the. I'm gonna try something. Um... Some of those thorny jumpers and stuff. I wonder if some of them... Some of them might drop. What's over here? Oh, for fireworks. That's cool. Um, I wonder if, if any of them drop desert mushrooms. It's definitely worth maybe finding out. So I'm going to maybe like and, um, kill a couple of thorny jumpers and things like that to see if any of them maybe drop a desert mushroom. They're made of plants, right? There's a chance that they might. That looks like it's something bitter bean. Lots of sand rock. Oh, I still didn't make myself. Do you, do you remember, like, ages ago, I needed one more, like, screw to make my stupid uh, weapon, and now I forgot to make it again. I've learned about bitter beans. Wonderful. So so usually it seems like the it's anywhere sort of shaded, surrounded by trees, maybe caves, that sort of thing, might have some mushrooms in them. So we'll have a little look around. Because if there is another mushroom spot, then it'd be good to know about. There was a cave up here, so that's why I'm a bit like, hmm, maybe a cave might be somewhere where mushrooms would grow. I'm going to have another look up here. As there was a cave up here. Mm, clearly not anymore. Or well, it's not where I remember it being. I'm sure it was around here somewhere. And maybe it was back here. This also gives me a chance to just like look and see if there's any mushrooms just generally around. Nope, no cave there. Okay. We'll just look around here as well. This is a, like a shaded area around the ship, so it's a crash spaceship.
I hate invisible walls. So annoying. Nothing around there. With more bitter beans. See, a lot of bitter beans around. Yeah, I'm just gonna check, check around inside this crash ship if I can. Doesn't look like I can really get inside it very easily or very much, so that's fine. So the next thing I wanted to try was uh, to see if uh, killing a thorny jumper or a few of them, see, see what kind of comes out of that. And maybe head across to their area. Something was glowing up there, but it was just the sun setting, I think. If you see something shiny, you've got to go towards it. It's the rules. So, thorny tripion. Thorny jumpers are straight ahead and a little to the right. I just want to see if they drop anything. Unfortunately, I got to smash them with my hammer, and that's not the best for that type of enemy, but never mind. Okay, so we got lizard tooth wood and a cactus spine. Yep, so it looks like lizard tooth, cactus spine. But as far as I can tell, because they were the only ones I didn't really know what uh, what I got off them. <clears throat> But as far as I can tell, there's only one place to get those mushrooms. So the next thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna ignore the rue there, is to try and get the opals and we'll wait and see if we, if another couple of the mushrooms spawn over the next few days. I mean, we've got five days for them to respawn there. And it is summer, which is, is the time of year that they apparently spawn, so that's fine too. Oh, I hate <laughs> the horse would get so stuck on this thing. Ah. So I want to go down to the breach and I want to just check the vending machines for opals. Uh, maybe if I can get some. I might be able to make that iron spear that I picked up. But the problem is I can't I pick things up before I know what ingredients I need for them sometimes. So it's it's a bit of a learning experience that one. Oh. What's this about? Hello That's mysterious enough, man. Mr. RVO was it? Remind me. Whose shop is this again? <laughs> Sorry, am I overstepping here? But I just feel there really must be a way for the two of you to work together. Mr. Mysterious, perhaps you just hadn't noticed this particular part yet. It's got a lot of potential. Surely <laughs> this one is mysterious enough to add to your thought. The guy has to carry it around. Do you know how heavy pottery is? Please, call me the Mysterious Man. Mr. Mysterious was my father's moniker. But on the subject of mysteriousness, I'm afraid this pot could hardly be called mysterious enough for one such as myself. It's at best quizzical. <laughs> it's at best quizzical. It has never been my intention to have my work be confined to a singular aesthetic, much less a single word. 
If my wares are of no interest to you, then I believe we are done here. I have other orders to attend to. You think I don't know what I'm talking about? You know, people don't come to this shop for the quality of the goods, right? You do know why they come, don't you? Don't be so mean. How dare you? Get out! Hey, don't take it personally. Look, I've been around. I've seen the best. If I brought my guys from Walnut Groove in here to see this dull junk you're peddling, they'd laugh their butts off at the mere notion that you're anything but an amateur. Ow! And what is that kiln you've got back there? Looks like it's from the Stone Age. Hey! That's my sister's livelihood you're talking about there, pal! Quiet, Javio. Indeed. I use a traditional kiln. Glazing requires a kiln with more advanced temperature controls. So, you know all about it. What's your excuse then? Old ways are best? Probably that she doesn't have the money to get a better kiln. No, money. And besides, though a traveler as yourself may have encountered such things, the more advanced kilns are rare, and their construction is still a well-guarded secret by masters within the ceramics community. Well, if you're a true artist, go and seek one of these masters out. Get off of your high horse and beg if you must. Tell them, I have no business being here, and you have no business acting as though I do. Then you get one for me. <laughs> Why would I do that? Uh, because you, you, you deserve to have to do it because you are being so rude. Mm -hmm. You said seek a master. You're the so-called master of trade. Who claims he can get any rare item from any rare place. She makes a point. Get me a new kiln and I'll prove to you that my ceramics are as good as anyone's in whatever sky it is you speak of. You think I'm really going to lug a kiln halfway across the free cities just so you can maybe feel better about yourself? Nah. Get me a diagram then. I'll have one built. What's in it for me? Now the best ceramics hookup in the free cities. Let's try that. You. <laughs> she laughed. Ah, you scared me. Why? Were you just standing back there quietly, waiting for a dramatic moment to enter the conversation? Look, I'm your Since... draw with joy noodles hookup. Okay, so you better be nice to me. We were just thinking about you. I'm going to need your help. Hey. I didn't agree to do anything yet. Hold your horses. <laughs> yes, it would be good to gain a high quality pottery connection in Sandrock. But if I'm going to spend my time on something that isn't a sure thing, it ain't going to be for free. Uh, okay. It is, as you say, Miss Amira, I am a master of trade. There is no item too rare for me to find. But such a service comes at a cost. 5,000 golds. Well, I do happen to have that many, but I am saving for stuff. What? Uh... You're really not afraid of taking advantage, are you? You think so? Nah, <laughs> really. I'm taking it easy on you guys. You know what? I actually happen to think gray, non-glazed pots are pretty neat all of a sudden. Perhaps we ought to forget about all of this price gauging and... No, Avio. His price... It is fair. I shouldn't have gotten my hopes up. Aww. Uh huh. Well, offers on the table. If you decide you want my help, I'll be staying at the Blue Moon for about three days. Come find me if you get the money. Or don't. Makes no difference to me. You know I'll do it for you, Amira. Hmm. Much less money. Am. Um, Amy. Amira, what should we do? Be quiet. Can't hear myself think. All our savings add up to around 3,000 goals. Maybe we could sell a few things, but... Are you really thinking of bankrupting us for our new kiln? Is it really going to be worth it? Probably is. How do we know that mysterious man, if that even is his real name, isn't just blowing smoke up both our backsides? Um... 
I bet I'll get some really good. Go on. What? You have that much money to spend on kilns? How long have you been hiding your wealth? Can builders make that much money? Yes, but. I can't accept that. If you want to help, perhaps it would be all right for you to lend us what we lack. 2,000 goals. 5,000. It's just too much. Oh, that's just like a day's worth of commissions. It's fine. It's wow. fine. It's fine. So you really want to do this, huh, Em? So I've got the extra two points with each of them for, for offering more. So that's good. And you don't even have to give them all the money. <laughs> yes. Trust me, Arvio. One of these temperature controlling kilns will open doors for my shop. And probably be a lot of fun, too. Thank you. You will be repaid in full very soon now come brother let us depart to the blue moon fetch the savings if you would ah yes the savings easy come easy go <laughs> Aww. Did i accidentally press x again i did what is it with me today pressing x all the time so we need to wait for the diagram for the kill and then apparently i need to build it as well as fund it um I need to go to bed. I, I don't have. I don't think I have time to go looking for bloom, blooming opals. We'll do that in the morning. There's too much going on today. It's fine. Cries. <laughs> Cries in the commissions I'm not taking. All right, bedtime for me. That was cool though, we got to help Amira and Avio with the kiln. I don't know what I'm doing wrong with the animals. Until I can look after them properly, I need to... I need to be careful. So the mushrooms are kind of growing. So what's up with you doodles? You've got some potatoes in there. They're your faves. It must be because I know because you're eating them all. I keep, I'm sure I keep buying tomatoes. Uh, every time I... Uh, I have no idea. I'll have to plant some tomatoes, I think. 100% happy, though. That's all right. really need a way to make fertilizer. I wonder if Heidi's got something like that to help me out. I could plant some more stuff. So I'm thinking maybe um, a quick plant of some pomatos. Sand rice seeds. I've got all sorts of stuff. All right, let's have a look. I'm sure I've got pomato seeds as well though. Yeah. So I'm going to plant all those in. You just take advantage of these plots that I've made and try and sort of make them better I mean I think that's part a lot of what Sandrock is about honestly so uh, E change the seed over sand rice I don't want sand leak I've got lots of wheat I've got lots of no I don't actually you know pomatoes oh sorry no I need to do the plot first I need to make a straw grid. I'm gonna go all out. That's that one's been not sorted out for ages so i feel like let's just go for it and do this thing right so straw grid's all done then i will plant like i said pomatoes probably 10 of them and then some other bits and pieces and then i've just got to keep an eye on the water and the fertilizer and stuff
You don't even have to water them every day, so I need to stop being so lazy about planting. Because my little, my little dude over there, he's relying on me. Right, so we're through all the pomato seeds. Sand rice there. Maybe some sand leeks. I'm just planting willy nilly though. I don't know whether I uh, need to be specific about it. Whether certain things maybe won't grow in this weather. That looks like I've planted all the seeds I have. That one needs a bit of water apparently. Um, it hasn't got any fertilizer. Not enough water in your inventory. Story of my life, isn't it, really? I'll get a fertilizer onto all of them. Some of them are very low on water, actually. So I might go in... Uh, well, I, I, yeah, there's some on the collectors. Hang on, let me come out of the farming thing. We'll collect the off the dew collectors. Then I'm going to go have a look for mushrooms, just see if there's any that have respawned. I'll grab the, may as well grab the recycled stuff. Oh no, the recyclers have finished. plastic shells okay then so we need to get on top of this don't we let's get on top of the iron scrap because that's good when Jensen's like I need some steel bars I'm like I got the I got this down You'll be like my best friend just because of that. It's not like I don't use all the stuff. I really do. <laughs> There's nothing that I'm like, oh, I've got so many of that. I don't know why I'm why I'm making so many, so much wood or so many bits of rubber or whatever. There's always something I, I can do with them. Right, so they're all working. I'm going to just go and double check the water tank. And I think I might need to get more water for the plants. Once you start planting things, um, water becomes very important. So let's see if I can make some out of the dew that I've collected. I can, that's wonderful. And I'm going to plant, I'm actually going to water my plants with it first. one up here that was really really dry super dry the rest are kind of all right i think i'm only gonna water ones that are like less than halfway that one in the corner there needs fertilizer as well they are beautiful Lovely, beautifully tended crops. Um, there are a couple of spaces if I had any more seeds. But I haven't actually looked to see if I've got more. I'm sure I do. Maybe it's just, it's only taking the ones that are in my inventory. Mountain rose. But that's not a good summer seed. Sweet potato pepper and sand rice though.
those in and I'll plant them. I may as well use up all the spots. Okay, just put some sand rice in. That will do. Come on, out of the planting menu, please. Do a quick sort all on all of this stuff. I've got a lot of stuff clogging my inventory up now. It's getting towards the point where I'm going to have to do a proper little thing on it. Actually, you foul the artifacts. You fowler, you fowler, you fowler. Gecko station, you fowler. You fowler, you fowler. Because it's the salvage, that's the, the, the reason why you get so much you fowler stuff. For some reason I've got loads of metal bars there. Ingredients. Well, that's a bit better. Um, I just do it like if I do little mini sorts every so often, then it means I don't have to do a big sort. Why does my horse not follow? Oh, I don't have a horse today. I need I need to redo my horse contract. Clearly, but I just want to quickly pop over. Oh, Elsie, what's hey, going down? You ain't doing nothing, are you? Come on, help me track down it. <laughs> have me yeah! it. Let's bag ourselves an it. So, here's the deal. Okay. I need your forging skills to help me scrounge up some bait. We need bugs and bird eggs. That's its favorite. Then, we lure it into my trap. And even if it grew itself a pair of wings, it'd never escape our clutches. <laughs> Is she after, like, a specific, um, fish, maybe? <clears throat> Alrighty, here's a list of stuff for you to get. Let me know when you've got the goods. And then, let the hunt begin. Okay, Elsie. Big Game Hunter. Um, How long do I have to do Big Game Hunter? As long as I want. Okay, so I just need to get some eggs. Trial by kiln I'm waiting on. Uh, I need to make the mushroom and meat thing. And I really don't have long to try and get the opals either. Oh, look! Mushroom respawned. Yes, I've got enough mushrooms now. Woohoo! And yeah, let's head over to the Yakmel Ranch, get myself a new horse for the week. And uh, see if any more meat is ready. Oh no, I need to change over my headphones. I got up this morning and uh, my headphones hadn't been seated properly on their cradle to recharge them. So the last sort of hour and a half, uh, they've been they've been charging, and I've been hoping that the pair that I was wearing last night, because I, I switched between two pairs, would last for longer. And they lasted about an hour and a half before they ran out. So yay! <laughs> sure, you wanted to know that. And look, there just so happens to also be two meat there. Fantastic. Gonna hand that in now. Oh, no, oh, no, no, no. Horse, 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 horse. Never go somewhere and try and do two things. Because you'll do one out of the two things. Or if you're me, you will anyway. It's, a, it's the common thing. So, shall we have like a. No, I'll, I'll, I'll carry on with the, the sandy horse, I think. It looks like there's another quest up here. Is, is it for Coop? Hello. Hey there. Yeah. See ya. I wonder if eventually he'll stop asking me to pick up all the poo off his ranch. I don't know. Maybe eventually it'll all be done. One. Two. Oh. 
Looking pretty clean, Coop. There's a whole load of yakmal over there. So we might find some yakmal poo over there. need to wait for them to poop some more. <laughs> I'm getting seeds from this. So how many more do I need? Four out of five. I need one more. One more, please. Come on, guys. Like, <laughs> I did too good a job, clearly. Oh, that's a throwing rock. That's not a poo. Do I need to come back later and do the last one? Is there a time limit on it? On it? Like, like, is there a time limit? Like, oh, nine hours. Ugh. So annoying. Does that mean I'm going to forget it? If I go and do other things, I'm going to forget about it. I know I will. You shouldn't give it again so quickly if there's not actually five poos to pick up. Just, yeah, I keep running around a bit. And the thing is, because it's like big blue question mark, a big blue exclamation mark. I think Coop might have to just be unimpressed with me then, possibly. But there is none to be found. None of the, the it's all clean. spent like the whole day doing this this is not this is not good entertaining viewing <laughs> no i'm not gonna be able to do it that's really irritating the last thing i can try and do is to go and pick up after um my yakmel and see if it counts doodles oh man you also have no poo ah. hey coco <laughs> Well, I think 
the... I've got one day and 12 hours left to try and, and work out how to get that to, that spear done. So I'm going to go and see if I can do it. Um, I, it may mean that my part-time work... Is, yeah, I need to make sure I leave that long enough between times. Because the game isn't going to make sure for me. So maybe something that needs a little looking into. He maybe needs to not be quite as frequent with giving that quest out. Right, so the breach... Let's have a little look. I will consume 120 stamina and probably about four hours of time. I want to look at the vending machine. Because that sometimes has stuff in it. It doesn't have opals. Oh, golly gosh. I don't know what to do, whether just to fight through the ruins or like, um, no, I've got, oh, I've only got a hammer. Ugh, I hate fighting with a hammer. Hey. I've got like a totally full inventory as well. I really did want to just go in there and look at the vending machine, but. I've got a full inventory, but I actually don't at all. So that's better. And at least it's an early level, so the hammer seems to be doing alright. I have no idea what I got out of that. It just seems to be like this missing thing like you just like where do you get opals from i don't know if maybe it's a commission thing for the civil corps it says monsters or um civil corps shop but so far i don't think in the game at all i've found any opals i have found a bit of i think um found some gems out in the desert. It does say quarrying, so that would be my next try on it, honestly, would be to try quarrying out in the desert and see if any opals drop out. But that would be my last ditch effort, I think, at that point. Nice. Multi embryonic correct fire. That oh, gives you like buffs and stuff. Nice. Vending machine. all the clothes and stuff in there at one point and see if any of them are like uh, good increases on what I've got. Don't do all the chests in case one just like pops out but I mean, I don't mind getting things like rubber and uh, and steel bars and all that sort of thing. That's fine. Oh, I think that's the wrong way. I think it's this way. But it might be that it's a possibility that I won't be able to do that commission and that uh, Pen will be a bit annoyed with me, but it sometimes, sometimes things like that happen. It's fine. Yeah. 
This goes on forever. the end. And I've got no, and a whole other layer to go. I always keep checking just in case. A relic bag. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's fine. It's just a little boss fight here. Go 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 go! And I I did get S level. That's all right. I got some uh, ruins tokens. And a whole load of stuff out of the chest there. Techno calendar, ruin tokens, engines, condensers, metal coils. It's not too bad, but. No, I, there's no opals. So, clearly, the only way to get them, then, it must be quarrying. But it is too late for that for me, so I think it's time for me to go to bed and I'll try and work it out in the morning. I've got one day left to try and do this. <laughs> um, and then, and uh, yeah, so I'll have a very quick look before I go to bed. Very quick look. Oh, I love that I've planted all of those now. I'm so happy with that. Uh, oh no, it's this one, isn't it? It's the... Oh look, all of my food is ready and I can make the other two. Okay, I'll make the other one when that one's done. That seems a bit weird. It's not allowing me to add to the queue for some reason. That's fine. Oh yeah. So now let's go to here, which is the... So, from the quarry, monsters, the civil core store. So I've not found any on any monsters. I've not found any in the civil core store. Opals. Um... Maybe they're in the abandoned ruins, uh, sorry, in the uh, actual, yeah, the abandoned ruins. But it's saying quarrying. I think quarrying is going to be my best bet. So I'm going to just do a whole bunch of quarrying tomorrow. We're uh, currently waiting for the last couple of the meat stuff mushrooms to be done. I'll definitely have them done in time. And the spear, I don't know. It just depends on whether I can get the right gem for it. Um, we're waiting for the kiln. I need to get a couple of eggs. That is not going to happen. Um, unfortunately, I need to just not take things off Cooper for a little while, I think. And uh, I think we're very nearly there with the stuff for the protection suits. So I'm going to head to bed. And I'm going to say goodbye for this episode. I'm super happy to have helped Amira with the kill today. That was amazing. So I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, then please do leave me a like below. If you'd like to see more, then please subscribe. I'll let you know when the videos are out. Hope to see you next time. In the meantime, please look after yourselves and keep being awesome.